crack i honestly just thought of this this topic because i'm on a row i did two other videos just before this you guys will be seeing them soon i don't know if i'll be splitting them up but nah bro this, I, I think I'm, I'm gonna call this the the trap of the nine nine to five it could be so broad it's like so broad but i'll get into what i mean so the trap of the nine to five in supermarkets and in any job actually but I, I'm specifically say supermarkets because that's what I work in, all right? That, 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 that's where I work. Anywho, so obviously when you have a job, you got tasks, you got things to do, you know, your manager slash maybe your team leader, there's different positions, you know, they expect you to do certain things. So for me, I'm in the freezers slash the fridges and I'm night shift. So i'm expected to do the load so like all the pallets that come in i basically got to do those morning kind of just fills makes the store look good you know during the day while the customers are there i come in around the afternoon tonight and do the you know the pallets and do whatever so my first priority is pallets okay so i, I do my pallets blah 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 you know make sure they're all done try to do, try to put as much stock on the shelf as possible so I'm like, okay, this is cool. The fridges take a long time. Fre freezers are super, like, I, I love the freezers. They're super fun and everything. Blah, blah, okay. So on Sundays is our big delivery because that's when we end up flipping the stock. That's when we change the displays. That's when we change the displays. And uh, so we get a lot of stock. We take all that stuff off and we're going to put, like, fucking half our pallets onto those bloody um displays because there's so many different ones some of them you know change but you, you gotta put so much stock so there's around about uh, it's like uh, it's a decent load for like two people about 11 pallets sometimes 11 12 can usually around 10 so 10 to 12 on average so you know we do the plates get go through them now the trap is with a lot of these companies is okay you'll do you know what you expected because they've got like a list they just like do load face up on some days it doesn't matter but i'm just in general do load face up there's like one or two other tasks that you're expected uh, that um they want you to do so you know i on the days that i don't have anyone because thursday and sunday i have someone friday said day i don't like um I have someone but they leave like a lot earlier than I do especially on Saturday they leave at 7 30 and I'm there till 2 30 like you know it's a, bit, it's a bit far away but okay so I gotta you know do all my tasks and pallets by myself so you know they're lonely you know being a being a, being a loner boy and shit but um yeah so I you know do those tasks blah 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 do all that but then you know you get up to like management and shit right you do all the tasks that you've been given right you do all the tasks you've been given they've asked of you and then you know you go up to them and they you know they complain about shit you know it's company shit they're gonna always complain about something you can never get away from some complaining old ass management because he just being a pain in my ass you know so it gets very annoying because the trap basically is it's very obvious everyone's been through this but the trap is literally they want you to do like more work than what you get paid for like you're on minimum wage they want you to do more work than you're paid for so what this is how it starts out right you start out doing you know doing what is expected of you 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 know do the minimum you're getting paid minimum but they want you to do a bit more okay so some people were like okay okay i'll do a bit more they, they do a bit more you know for like maybe a couple couple of times you do it um you know mansion and team leaders like oh no uh, that's really good keep doing that but eventually that becomes the norm that will become your norm and the norm and anytime you do under that they'll like pull you aside and be like oh you're not doing as much you're not you know there's so something up blah blah all this shit even though you're already doing more than what is expected of you anyway 
so then you're like okay okay i gotta do even more and then it just becomes the infinite cycle of oh, i need to do more i need to do more i need it and then, then you're just being paid the same you're being you're doing like the work of two people because my manager she does the work of two people because the, ma the management doesn't want to give her anyone there was a new cousy who came to our i'll also make a video about this a new cousy who came to our department but he doesn't work in our department at the time because the other you know the other departments just take him for us so she doesn't have anyone so she's doing the work of two people and that's like that's her norm and every time she doesn't like perform you know she she she's threatened with a you know a write-up or a warning and it's just like that's what happens when like that's why i'm like so annoyed because of my job i'm like yeah nah I'll, I'll i'll do like i'll try to do as much as i can and then they just you know expect more 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 and i'm just like well, what the fuck's the goddamn point if every time i do more that just becomes my normal then what's the point i'd rather just do minimum just say fuck it why am i gonna do more and more and just you know get paid the same and like oh yeah after two years bro it's the supermarket you ain't up getting up rid of shit you're gonna be still in that same goddamn that, that same goddamn place i'm gonna be i'm gonna be gone from the job probably by then because fuck that but you just want me to just do more and more and more and then you know keep my pay the same and then also drop a couple people from my department so you save money because i'm doing so much now that you don't need like certain people anymore like that shouldn't be how it works there shouldn't be like five people in our department when there's two different shifts for two two different times like that nine to five track man bullshit